I've been having some issues with my Apollo Twin interface. I don't know what the situation is, but right now I'm hearing a lot of static. The mic lines are turned down, so I'm gonna try to play some music out of it and see what happens. Oh my gosh. Is it time for me to get a new interface, bro? I think it's time, bro. Damn, definitely not the news I wanted to hear, bro. Story of my life, man. So yeah, I had to step out for a minute and go get a new interface, man. So, okay. So basically uh, I had the Apollo Twin Duo, you feel me? Uh, but now I have the Apollo Twin Duo MK2. I guess before I had the MK1. And to be honest with you, I had that interface for like almost 10 years. I had that interface my first year at Berkeley. Um, or maybe my second year is when I got into the music production program. So I had that interface uh, since 2016 and it just gave out on me, y'all. The computer doesn't send signal through the interface like it's supposed to. So I'm just hoping it's this Thunderbolt cable because I've had this cable for equally as long and maybe the cable's just burnt out so that I don't need to make this expensive purchase because this thing was uh, almost $900 and I wasn't trying to spend $900 today. In fact, I wasn't trying to spend any money today at all. Like, I'm a producer, I'm not a consumer. But since I have this thing, I'm gonna try to plug it in to see. It does look a whole lot better than the other one. I had a little light skin one last time, but shit, I'm fucking with this look. You feel me? And really, it does the same exact thing. It has the same exact plug-in. So you really just plug everything in the same. All right, so boom. So I got this new interface plugged in. One thing I do like about it is that it has an actual mono button, which is really cool. Also, it has an actual mute button, which is also really cool because on the last one, I had to fight with this big, center knob trying to push it down to mute like the monitor when i wanted to turn the mic up and so now they actually made it a button and that alleviates so much it also has a dim button with the dim button you can play music really loud or you could just demo it on like a soft type of feel you feel me like i'm about to show y'all so i'm gonna start off loud right without touching the volume i'm just gonna push the dim button and then it's gonna go dim for like you know an immediate response in case you want to talk to the artist woo -woo 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 with the people in the booth you feel me check me out so it's on loud right now right i'm gonna let it rock for a little bit i'm gonna let the beat drop and then i'm gonna show y'all how the dim button works peep now I just hit the dim button, you feel me? See how soft that is? That's fire, right? That's so convenient. Like, oh my God, that's awesome. This also allows the producer to hear the music on different levels. Like you can hear what the mix is gonna sound like when you turn it up. Like I can hear everything in the mix like this, you feel me? If I turn it up, I know what it sounds like if somebody turns it up in their car. I don't know like what comes out, the bass, whatever. If I turn it down, now I can hear what people most likely are gonna hear like on the radio at a normal volume, you know what I mean? So that's that. Also it has a talk back button in case I wanna talk to the artist in the booth. 
You feel me? Like, I think that's really cool. Yeah, man, like, I'm really fucking with it. Honestly, it's like money well spent. Even now, I already done went ahead and ordered a new Thunderbolt cable just to test the last one out. Honestly, the Thunderbolt cable is kind of old, but I'm using the same Thunderbolt cable with my new one, and it seems to be working fine. So I really just think my last interface definitely just was on its last leg. It fought the good fight, and it was just time to replace it with a new one. So I'm grateful for this one that I got, man. I'm gonna turn up with this one for sure. I mean, honestly, my Thanksgiving really was everything that I wanted it to be. I wanted it to be something super chill, super like, I wanted it to be something that reflects who I am as a person and I'm super chill. Like, I don't like to do too much, you know, like I don't really like to be all outside. And honestly, I'm not even really down with the idea of like stuff in my face or none of that. So I just wanted to do something like super vibey um holidays i really don't celebrate holidays like that i really just be chilling i hate holidays because people always want to take off work you feel me um but for the most part i definitely did everything i wanted to do um it was just super chill i really enjoyed like the solitude of it all um, i could have went home and all that but i just i really wasn't feeling like traveling like that or nothing i didn't want to like do too much and make arrangements like i don't know bro. that's really not that's really not, not my vibe for real um but as you can see bruh like i ain't miss no beats i ain't miss nothing with a little turkey you feel me i don't like turkey no way but honestly the reason why i want to document this so much is because like maybe one day i'm gonna be really successful whether it be with youtube or with something else and i really wanted to document thanksgivings like this one because I wanted to see the growth. You know what I mean? Like I'm pretty sure every Thanksgiving won't be the same for me. So I feel like I wanna document like the slow ones now because one year I'm gonna have a lit Thanksgiving. I might be out the country. I might be, mark my words, like it's gonna be so different, bro. Once this YouTube stuff like take off, it's gonna be different. Like I'm gonna be with family and people that I choose to be around me, like real friends, not fake friends. And it's just like, bro, I just like seeing growth, like creating something one day and then seeing the progress maybe like a year from now. Like, I think that's so fire. So that's really why I decided to like, you know what I'm saying, document the solo Thanksgiving or do a little solo Thanksgiving this year, you feel me? Um, but honestly, bro, like, I hope you guys had a great Thanksgiving. Thank you guys for rocking with me today. Today was super chill. If you haven't already, please consider subscribing to my channel. I surely appreciate it. Right now, I'm almost at 40 subscribers, but that's cool, because I really just started my YouTube page October 1st, and I've done a lot of great things in life that you guys will soon find out about through subscribing to my channel. But until then, I need y'all to subscribe and just rock with me, bro. Like, there's so much stuff about me that you guys have yet to find out that I want you to know. So, like, you can show your support by subscribing to the channel. You feel me? Job, bro. I don't even have much to say today. I want to get back to making this beat, and I guess I'll check in with y'all later. All right. Peace.